G'day guys, just here with my YZ250 today. Um, today I'm going to put on a brand new DEP exhaust pipe. Got the whole system here. I'm also going to replace my standard levers with these, the RHK lever. They spin around and do all these sorts of fancy things. They have a year's warranty, so they must be quite good. Considering brand new motorbikes don't have any warranty, they mustn't be too bad. So anyway, the first thing I'm going to do is take off my standard exhaust system. This standard pipe here, uh, underneath this um, protective se section here, it's really beaten up. It's pretty bad. Um, I've only had the bike a couple of weeks. Also, I've got a new seat cover coming. It hasn't arrived yet. I'm going to go over this bike and get it really looking really good. I'm going to probably upgrade this plastic kit to the newer one in time. I've put some new... Uh, new levers on it so far uh, not not levers grips sorry these levers will be replaced you can see this one here's a bodgy bolt is in there and he's you know it's it's, it's all bodged up and um, also when I bought the bike of course I didn't notice when I was doing the inspection but the front wheel wasn't the correct wheel it had a WR wheel on it which had the mechanism for the the speedo in there so um, I had to replace this, this wheel, and luckily my friend found a set of wheels for a YZ250 on one of those Facebook pages for cheap, and it came with the front and rear wheel, and so I got those, I've put new brake pads in the bike already, so I've got the wheels, the other wheel here, which was on it, it's this piece here for a speedo, so I'm assuming it's off a WR, but it does have a really good tyre, which I'll eventually put on that other wheel so that wheel needed to be replaced did get another back wheel which is here so I do have a spare back wheel which is really good and the guy that sold me these wheels also had a brand new rear sprocket the other sprocket the guy had on this when I purchased it was a 45 tooth it was really small and made the gearing really uh, tall on this bike it wasn't much good for motocross at all uh, but of course when I put the proper size sprocket on, the chain was too short, so I had to replace the chain. I've also replaced the rear tyre because it was basically bald. Um, so these are the things you do when you buy a used motorcycle. You always find things that aren't the way that you like them, or things that are just bodged up. Um, yeah, just not happy with the certain things. And also this pipe has been bent. There's a, quite a large dent here, and there's a real big one behind this section here but it's also bent and it's basically touching the frame in this section so this pipe is definitely required replacement that's why I've gone with the the DEP pipe it's all new so what I'm going to do is obviously I'll take this pipe out it's a whole system take this pipe out I'll take that one off I'll put this one on put these new levers on which will get this all nice um, we'll start it up and see what it sounds like with this this new exhaust pipe okay just finished working on the YZ finished the pipe off looks really nice actually but yeah um, it obviously fits a bit better it doesn't have anything touching there on that frame anymore obviously because it's new and not bent it looks really nice and shiny any gripes yes I do have a couple of gripes with this pipe there's two o-rings that go inside there up against this flange now you think if you're buying a new pipe it would come with two brand new o-rings but no you have to put the old ones in luckily these old ones were okay and there was nothing wrong with them but other than that and this here you think you could get some new rubbers when you buy the the new pipe it's the only thing that I'm uh, I don't know, not disappointed in, but sort of thought I was sort of expecting new rubbers with it. But it looks good, fits good. It looks really nice actually, much better than the old one. And I've fitted these levers. They're much harder to change than the uh, the original ones, or maybe it's just that I'm not used to this style. But um, hopefully, with the reputation they have, obviously. Uh, you don't have to do it again, but they do all these sorts of 
fancy things, uh, but um, obviously, obviously they bend back, so less chance of breaking them. But yeah, they're on. So we've got new rubbers, new levers. The pipe's new, looking good. New chain and sprockets have been put on. It's got new brake pads, new tire. That wheel was replaced because there was a bodgy one on there. And uh, there's a seat cover to come. But that's it for today, except for one important thing. Let's start it up and see what this new pipe sounds like. actually think it sounds a little bit louder than the original one. I thought it would be quieter, but I don't think so. Maybe because it's in the shed, but it sounds really loud. Well, anyway, that's it. Until next time, and we play with some more things. Thanks for watching.